Hello cellists! Today we're going to work on Lightly Rill. This is the third song in the Suzuki book. And it starts with what I call a tunnel finger. So find third finger on your third tape, on the D string. And you want to put it down and arch your finger so that it's not touching the A string. Right? But you can still get the D string. Sometimes the bow will mess this up, so I recommend you put it down for now and just pluck. Right? See if you can pluck A and keep third finger down strong enough that we get a ringer, not a thud. But a... It takes a little bit more strength than you've had before because you're up on your fingertips. So, the trickiest thing about lightly row is keeping fingers down. So, every time you do this, if you go like this, A, three, three, lift up, four, one, one, lift up, you're going to find that you're doing twice as many motions as you need to, maybe even more than twice the number of motions. Remember, it's just as much effort to pick up a finger as it is to put it down. And so by doing this over and over again, you've created double the amount of work. And one of the keys to playing clean is doing the least amount of work, being very efficient in your approach. So we're going to pluck lightly row first. Get that tunnel finger down. You can check it if you want. And then we go A, 3, So, third finger stays down quite a bit when you're playing open A, and if you can get that arched, then you can, you can figure out how to keep their, your fingers down. Um, this is a pretty long piece to memorize in one chunk, so I recommend you breaking it up. You know, learn it a line at a time if you're doing it from memory. Otherwise, you'll find you get halfway through and you get confused. So, before you get too excited about doing it from memory, make sure that you've practiced it in small chunks. Um, keeping fingers down will help a lot. Once you think you've got that, we'll pick up the bow and we'll work on the bow stroke, which is nice and short, right? <laughs> You notice I'm right here in the middle of the bow. Some people like to play it too close to the frog and then you'll get scratches. You also get accidental hits because there's so much weight here that will push you into the A string. So try to play around the balance point with a heavy detache stroke um, with arched fingers keeping your fingers down. Great. Happy practicing, cellists.